Hi golfers, Nick here from American Golf and down the entry store. Today I have with me the Cobra Forged Tech Black Iron. I've got the 5 iron here in one length, so the shaft is 37.25 degrees, same as the standard 7 iron. I did review this on my channel last week when I hit the 9, the 7 and the 5. I had a few comments from people saying the 5 iron can't hold the green. So we're going to do a test today. We're going to hit some shots into the green set up on the GC2, this is on the range setting. I'll put the green at about 185 to the flag. So we're going to be looking at whether this Cobra one length Forge Tech 5 iron, 23 degrees, probably one golf balls, could hold the green. So I'm going to hit, start off with my normal draw, we're going to hit a few different shapes, <clears throat> we're going to take a look at some data, we're going to take a look at what PJ Tour players would expect from a 5 iron, just to see whether this club can actually hold the green. Okay, so a nice little draw, <clears throat> pretty good line, it's pitched just over the pin about 190, and just about head onto the green there. So launched at 14, spin rate just over 5,000. If you look at the PJ Tour players, we'll be launching it around about 12 degrees, spinning it at about 5.4. So that launched a little bit higher, just spun a little bit less. And slightly out the heel that. Not my best strike, but it's going to catch the edge of the green. Just about held onto the edge there, so not bad. Strike slightly out the heel. Launched at 14, span at 5,000 again, similar sort of results. So there's a couple of sort of little draws. I'm just going to try and, try and hit a high draw. So I'm expecting this to hold. Hit that pretty good. Drawing back nicely. That's definitely holding the green. So launched at 16, spun at 4,000. <clears> so I'm going to hit a hit a fade now. Okay, nice little fade. Pitching just right at the pin. And just holding the green. So, so far, so good. Launched at 12, spun back to 5,000. Okay, so last shot, I'm just going to try and hit a straight shot if I can, or straight as possible. High straight shot should easily hold the green this. Okay, pretty good. Pretty straight shot, just slight curve to the right. Is it going to stand the green? Yeah, stop pretty quick there. Okay, so that definitely spun up a little bit more. Spun at 5.5, five, launched at around about 17. So I'm just going to sit down now and take a look at some of that data in a little bit more detail. Okay, so you've seen me hit some shots there on the GC2. I have to say I'm a massive fan of these golf clubs. You saw there with the performance hit, like five shots, I think all of them held the green. I'm just going to take a look at some of that data. Also, I did review the Cobra Forge Tech Black Iron last week in one length. If you've not seen that, check it out. So just taking a look at some of the data, so I started off just hit a couple of normal shots to begin with. Both of those shots launched, put the data on the screen here, both of those shots there launched around 14 and spanned just over 5,000. Um, first one, pitch 190, rolled out to 198. Second one, pitch 184, rolled out to 192. So both those shots there, both rolled on about eight yards, which you'd kind of expect with a five iron, just stand, using like normal conditions on a range there, um, on a flat lie. So you would expect some sort of run out with a five iron. So around about eight yards, I'm not totally surprised by. Um, certainly all my shots held the green there, as you saw. So I tried to shape the ball a little bit different just to see what would happen. So looking at, I hit one big draw there, which launched at 16, uh, spun a little bit less at 4.2, but even still, that still held the green. That ran on a little bit more, about 11 yards. But if you think about most greens, most of them are gonna be sort of at least 20 yards deep so I think you can hold the green certainly with a, with this 5 iron so then I hit the fade shot which pitched at 108 rolled out to 197 so again I had about 9 yards of roll 
launched a little bit low around 12, span at 5.3, and at the end there I hit, tried to hit that straight shot as possible, which had a very slight curve to the right, that launched at 17, span at five and a half thousand. So if you take a look at the PJ Tour players, I did mention it in the video earlier, they'll be launching their five iron around 12 degrees, and they'll be spinning it at about 5.4. So if you take a look at all those shots that I hit there, launch angle on average 14.6, spin rate 5,000. So spin rate was a little bit down compared to the PJ Tour players, but certainly launching a little bit higher may have a little bit more chance to stop on the green. So average of about nine yards rollout on most of those shots there. I was quite impressed with that. I think that club can hold the green. I'm interested to hear what your thoughts are. Golfers, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget we've got these at All American Golfs, ready for you to try for free. In demo, we've got them in one length and in standard length and in the F8 as well. Don't forget, we're still doing double value trading details on the website and also 0% finance. Details are on the website. But thanks for watching guys and we'll see you again soon.